crowd optimistic. So very warm conditions yet again in the afternoon. Equation 318 to win for 50 overs. And an asking rate of 6.36. Well, those numbers would suggest he's been a fabulous performer for India. A lot depends on how he goes about it. He'll probably get, have to play innings that gets close to his best of 183. His partner playing his 401st one day international, Sachin Tendulkar. 186 not out, what they would give for Sachin to make that today. Ideal batting conditions for both the Indian opening players. Ball probably won't swing around as much as it did this morning. It's a bit drier this afternoon, but the pitch is superb. Brett Lee will be bowling the first over for the Australians. Got a great one-day international record. An average of under 23, best of five for 22. He's bowled well this series. Was injured for a long time with an ankle injury, but back into the fray. Has been very good for the Australians. Will attack with two slips. An interesting field set, backward point and point. A big gap between the man at uh, cover point and mid-off. Reason being, Ganguly likes to play in the dead air. Tense moments for the crowd as well. We're hoping India can uh, pull off a victory here. It's going to be a difficult run chase, but you never know with a good start. Anything can happen. Ganguly will be the man on strike. Also important for the Australian bowlers to start off well. Like you mentioned, they bowled first in the last match in Vadodara. There was a better swing available. Brackley likes to bowl a fuller length with the odd shot delivery to push push the batsman onto the back foot. Would he get any swing? Especially to the left hand area, we're trying to swing it into Ganguly. Get him out bold or LBW and then just push the odd one across the left hand towards the slips. Will be the first runs on the board. It's a no ball. It's going to be a free hit. He's bowled a number of no balls in this series. Brett Lee does get very close to the front line, and he's over the line. So free hit to Ganguly. Yet to get off the mark, but this is his ideal opportunity. I don't know what Brett Lee will do here, whether he'll go short or full. Maybe a slow ball. It's in the air. Doesn't matter. Gilchrist getting underneath it. He'll just pick up the single. Was in the air for a long, long time. Let's see Simons when he had the opportunity. Along with Hopes, they picked up two. Just a single. He went for the short delivery, Brett Lee. Gave himself some room, Ganguly. Just got a top edge. Adam Gilchrist lets it bounce. He probably could have caught it with a dive. Only got one. Thought they may have come back for the second, but Sachin Tindulka now on strike. Umpire just signalling one short one for the over. It's going to be Tindulka to face his first delivery. Very good start for Leeds, two for no loss. Good talent for Australia. Mitchell Johnson been swinging the ball over here. Again, a bit of swing. But generally bowls are full of length. Don't see him overdo the shot deliveries. It's a good start again. Almost into the block hole.
Yeah, full, but good shape. That would have gone on to hit middle stump. Ganguly adjusted well at the end. So there is swing in the air. It's gone hard at that. It's a quick outfield and they'll get to the fence. First boundary for India. First one for Ganguly. A little bit of swing again for Johnson. It was a fairly shortish delivery and you're right, Shiva. Ganguly did go hard at that ball, was edged. Four runs to Ganguly. He moves on to five. Slips waiting for that nick. Oh, and that's a beautiful shot off the back foot. Very strong through that area. Four more runs to Ganguly. Ten for no loss. A couple of boundaries in the last over. It's brought the crowd alive. Expect a few more, especially from the bat of Ganguly. Just a little bit of width. Waited for the ball to come on to him. Played it late. And played it into the gap. Did something different with that one. Gets off the mark, Tenduka. This lower delivery was it the cutter from Bradley. Has he got enough? He's got into the gap. This will be a tester. Once again, the outfield is quick. Saurav Ganguly scoring them in boundaries. Another beautiful shot from Ganguly. Once again, off the back foot, just punching the ball through the covers. Brad Haddon just could not reel this in. It was quite full, but he played it off the back foot. And again, good timing from Ganguly. No, 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 no. It's 15 for Nolos. Will result in a boundary for Tendulkar. Really not a happy man. Very good delivery from Brett Lee. It was short, dug in, and it was right on the money. Exactly where he wanted it. 147 k's an hour. Tendulkar going for the hook shot. Got a top edge. And straight over the keeper's head for four. Good bowling by Lee. Unlucky. This is much better. Bit of sting was taken off the ball. And like we saw in the Australian innings, there will be plenty of boundaries on this ground. Well, that was absolutely hammered by Tendulkar. And you're right, Shiver. Brad Hodge did get a hand to it, but it was hit too powerfully. Bang! And diving effort from Hodge, but didn't take enough off it. Two fours in a row now to Tendulkar. Could be another boundary. Yes, it is. Three boundaries of the last over. India, 28 for no loss. Three fours in a row off Brett Lee's over. Two of the edges and one right off the middle of the bat. But the last ball was a scrambled scene. Tendulkar hitting through the line of the ball. Got an outside edge and raced away for four. Good thing about Brett Lee, he always keeps a smile on his face. It went through over the last one, 12 runs coming off it. So both the openers getting in. <laughs> a 
hit slashed hard. What a piece of work in the deep. Brett Lee totally misjudged it. Looked like there was just going to be a single. Took the ball turn just before it got to Lee. Four boundaries of the last four balls. Well, Brett Lee will not want to see this replay. It was wide, slashed away from Ganguly, but it just checks there, spins away from Brett Lee. Oh dear. Crowd letting him know about it as well. <laughs> Nowhere to hide down there. Another hold up. Problems behind the sight screen. Taking the aerial route. More authority on that shot. They have just gone the distance. We'll wait for confirmation. Signals the boundary, maybe marginally inside the boundary rope. Good shot from Sachin Tendulkar. Got the crowd going that shot. And why wouldn't it? it? Was brilliant on the up, inside out, over cover. Only just short of the rope. Launched into it. Signal the boundary. <laughs> Good follow up cricket. Picking up a single to keep strike. It's 40 for Nolas. Flat out, and there's a beautiful shot through mid wicket. All timing and grace. Magnificent hit. This is a lightning outfield. You beat the infield, and there's no pulling it back. Beautifully done, just the balance. He doesn't overhit them, he doesn't reach out for them, lets them come close to the body all along the ground. Wait it till the last instant. He's wicket is slow, just the kind of wicket that the Indians like to bat on. So it's up to them to convert this start. And not swinging importantly here. Tendulk is a real worry for the Australians. He's scoring all around the park. shot there from Tendulkar, just a flick of the wrists and he's going back for two, will it be tight? He's there comfortably, he's got good pace Sachin Tendulkar but is the difference Aaron, like bowling to Tendulkar in this sort of form Ganguly is such a lovely cover drive and square driver but you can draw him up on leg stump Well take a look at the leg stump half volley that was dispatched that's the blue delivery for four by Tendulkar, that's Johnson to Tendulkar Yes, he's in his prime form as such, and he's playing good cricket. Even the previous game just got out for about 40 yard, but it needed a beauty to get rid of him. So Hayden and Clark catching on the offside, and that's good batting by Tendulkar. Always a single there. And Ganguly's hit some beautiful cover drives so far in this innings. You just can't give him any width outside of stump. Yes, those four blue balls all outside the off stump. Silken he is. He, he just just a master in that direction. Last ball for Johnson. Gets on the leg stump for Ganguly. Just a single to end the eighth over, and India 48 for zero. Backs away Ganguly and smashes it over cover for four. That finishes the ninth over. India 54 for none. Well, he took him by surprise, Bradley. Last ball of the over, just withdrew, made room for himself, freed his arms. It's a pretty effective shot these days, especially get the front foot out of the way, get some room for yourself. And Ganguly has been pretty adept at this. Just make sure that your front foot goes towards mid-wicket and the whole ground is available to you.
Well, Sachin has batted well. He started off a little circumspect, but then top edging this one for four. And this was hit with a vicious bar. Bit of an outside edge, but that was it. And then this. That was inside out shot over extra cover exceptional. Oh, and there's another fine shot from Sachin Tandulka. As with Simons, it's not just about the power. That was delicately done. Clever as well. Sometimes can prove dangerous when you are deliberately trying to turn it fine. Sometimes it can just take a fine edge and then end up in the wicketkeeper's glove. So not the easiest of shots to play. Especially when it's the off spinner coming into it towards your bat. Really got to watch it all the way. He advances again and on drive. Masterclass from Sachin Tendulkar. Tough shot to play, but he plays it as well as anyone in the world. What a shot. He advanced onto hooks. The intention I thought would have been to go over the top, but just take a look at this. Beautiful, magnificent. What a pretty shot. Oh, you can go miles to watch that. Not so good for James Hopes. Beautiful V plane. He advances again. Subtle wrist to the leg side. Has he timed it enough to go for four? Good work from Hodge on the boundary. Save two. End of the over. India 67 for no loss. And he's really launched into that one. That's going to be six all the way. What a hit by Ganguly. Wonderful. That is the 50th hit for six in the series. He really clubbed that one, bludgeoned it in fact. That is mine made up. And that's on the onside for you. Oh, awesome power. Brilliant hit. In the commentary box now is Barry Richards and with him is Ramiz Raja. Thank you, Arun. Great oh, yes. action from uh, the Indian oh, pair. 78 without a wicket, just about a perfect base for uh, the rest to come and uh, target Australia. This really was big from Saurav Ganguly. Launched it in the orbit. A lot of bottom hand and it uh, went a mile. There he goes. There she goes. Six. Sachin Tendulkar is very best. He reaches his 50 with that magnificent six. India's 100 is raised as well. From the moment it left the arm, he was down the track, and that's what he's going to do to Brad Hogg. He knows that Brad Hogg is the uh, the one bowler that can really uh, put India on the back foot, and Tendulkar is going to take it up to him. Short boundaries. Nicely played inside out, straight drive. Hard gets around it, throws on the bounce to the bowler. Looking for that inside out drive to the offside. This was brilliant, magnificent. A towering six over mid wicket. In two minds, sort of Ganguly with a wrong call, such in Tendulka. Very lucky, really, to come back in time. Ganguly down the track, it's a big one. Forget about it. Forget about it. It's a six. 50 for sort of Ganguly as well. Didn't really get to the pitch. Just shows you how good these bats are. Sarav Ganguly delighted, of course. Almost stopped his shot. Got a bit of elevation. Dropped just inside the advertising boardings, but over the old rope that they have now as the boundary. So six for Sarah Ganguly. Goes again. This time he opts for that slot sweep. There's a fielder there, and once again being tested on the boundary. This is a perfect start from the Indian openers.
on the track and he uh, didn't middle it but it was good enough to sail over the rope the track and I think Sachin will be looking for the same area he might go inside out he can pick hog and bowls uh, at the back of the hand into and away from the right handers oh Tim Dorka with power pulls hard all the way for four too much time to just swivel on the back foot and he's crunching the ball at the moment but again pick from the line it was the wrong one Pull the Chinaman outside the line of leg stump. Could be well wide. Again, the wrong one doesn't come out all right. Extra bit of bounce. But he placed it extremely well because the fielding in the deep has been superb by the Australians. He hit that hard. He's oh. going to go hard again. Has it split the fielders? No. Simon's just mopping up. Backward square leg on the fence. Another single. The other thing is Shiv, these last 15 overs with the change of ball have been costly all series. And it's harder and it's newer. It cost India 131 in the Australian innings. So you'd think there'd be something similar for the Indians today. So you reckon they can have a target of uh, 16 overs, 130 runs on the run chase with wickets in hand? And a lap sweep for Tendulka. All the way for four. Beautiful shot. Just waited for it to come to him. He's hitting him everywhere today. A couple of shots he plays brilliantly. One is a straight drive. The other is the paddle fine. You see the adjustment that he makes. Also the slower delivery gave him that extra bit of time. But the placement has been outstanding. I think you've got to get fuller. You've got to get him driving down the ground where you've got mid off and mid on, back on the fence. And if he's good enough to time it in between them, well. Oh, and there's a stumping chance. Gilchrist likes it. Full ball down the leg side. The Aussies have probably talked about this and set it up. And look to give him the charge. Clever piece of bowling from James Hopes. Slipped it down the leg side, and Adam Gilchrist was onto it in a flash. Be very anxious moments for the entire spectators here for the Indian team. Let's take another look. Comes out of the crease, the base come out. Oh, he's got to go. Unfortunate, but he's got to go. He's given him the charge. Good piece of bowling. Great wicket keeping. How quickly he gets rid of the bales. That's on the line. Nothing behind the line. That's the breakthrough achieved for me. Well, bonus for the Australians. Been a few stumpings in this series for the keepers. And he's out. Sachin Tendulka innings comes to an end for a clever piece of bowling from Hopes, keeping from Adam Gilchrist. And the crowd giving him a standing ovation. He's batted beautifully today, Sachin Tendulka. And this is a good look for Tendulka just advancing down the crease. Getting back, but Gilchrist ready for it. Saw it all the way. So Sachin Tendulkar on his way for 72 and India 140 for one.